welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabby if you're new here and today we are back with another video in my try on series. Today we are trying on all the jackets at Lululemon that you could find in stores right now. If you guys haven't seen the previous videos in this series, trying on all the leggings, the shirts, shorts, and the sweaters, then definitely go check those out. Of course, I will have everything linked down below in the description for you guys, so make sure to check that out if you're interested in anything I try on today. I know this has been kind of overdue. I've gotten so many requests to do jackets and I've finally been able to do them for you guys. So I hope you really enjoy this video and let's get right into it. Okay, so I own absolutely zero Lululemon outerwear. I counted the fine jackets more of a sweater, hence why they are in the sweaters video. So let's just head straight to Lululemon and see what they got in store. slippery rain jacket material it was very snug so definitely size up if you want to fit a sweater under it the zippers were super hard to undo because they basically don't have anything to really hold on to which was definitely a downside but cute little reflective details on it I love the shape of this jacket but yes yeah, super lightweight so definitely size up because I would need a sweater under it Next we have the cross chill jacket. I thought this jacket had a nice flattering silhouette to it. It was a pretty good windbreaker with like a soft shell interior and a lined interior on it. It had lots of pockets and it was just a little bit longer in the back for some coverage. The next jacket I tried on is the non-stop reversible bomber. This was very comfortable, but definitely a shorter length. It's not really my style, but I thought it was pretty cool that it was reversible. I think this jacket would be a great staple for that transitional season from winter to spring, as it felt like it would be warm enough, but still kind of crop. Next, we have the Glide Along Soft Shell. I definitely recommend sizing up as this one did feel a little bit tight on me but I definitely felt this one is just too long of a jacket for my short, tiny body, but I really enjoy the color. The hood was super tight to get on though. Next we have the Down For It All jacket. I honestly really love this jacket. I love the side paneling type pocket thing they got going on, the Lululemon silhouette, the hood, just everything about it. I think it is a perfect spring jacket. It is water resistant, so it's perfect for keeping you warm during those rainy spring days. Next is the Pack It Down jacket, which is super similar to the Down For It All jacket. The only difference is this one is warmer for when it's snowing. I actually really enjoyed this jacket as well. It's a perfect like, puffy jacket it even comes with a bag to roll it up and pack it away but yeah i was super impressed with this jacket as well now we have the pack it up jacket the pockets were kind of weird and the cinch on it made it flare really awkwardly on my body so this jacket just wasn't for me i do enjoy the camo though and it does come with a bag so that you can pack it up now we have the Goal Smasher jacket, which is made for running. It is super lightweight. I would even recommend going up a size, which I did here to fit a light sweater under it, but I thought it was kind of weird in the transparency of the white, so I definitely would not get it in this color, but it was all right. Now we have the Down For It All vest, which is exactly the same as the jacket. I thought this one is super comfy, but it's a little tight at the neck and it kind of pokes you a little bit, so that's definitely a downside, but overall, I really enjoy this vest. 
Now we have the pack it down vest, which again is the same as the jacket. I thought this one was surprisingly very comfortable. It did not poke me at the neck. However, I thought it was just a little bit boxy and not as figured flattering as the down for it all vest, but I love the color of this one too. Next, we have the ready to go jacket. This one is super light. Again, I'm just not a huge fan of the cinching at the bottom here. I absolutely love the colors. However, putting on the hood did make the jacket very tight at the neck. Now we have the Rain Rebel Jacket. It is very long and very lightweight. It's a great rain jacket, but again, I think it's just a little bit too long for me and it makes me even shorter than I am, but it has a little panel for breathability here. And of course the hood was awfully hard to put on. And lastly, we have the Polar Pace Run Jacket. This one is currently on markdown. It did have little rubber bands as well to like keep the jacket from slipping and pockets in the back, which I wasn't a fan of. It was super comfortable. I love the length of it and the shape, but I just hate the design on it. And that is all for the jackets that I could find in my size at my local Lululemon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. And let me know down below your opinions of some of these jackets. Which ones did you like? Which ones do you maybe want to pick up next? I would love to know. I definitely want to redo the shorts and skirts since the last time I did it, it was kind of fall winter, so they didn't have that many. And I know that they're coming out with a lot more shorts now so hopefully I will be able to redo that video let me know if you want to see a updated trying on all the shorts at lululemon I know that they sell out super fast in the store so hopefully I will be able to do that for you guys and I'll see you in the next one bye